Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Gemini. This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for uh, three months from now. Okay, so yeah, this is just like a special little uh, reading that I'm doing uh, for three months from the date that you watch it. So I'm recording this on March 29th, so this would be you know, end of June, beginning of, throughout July, something like that. The timing is fluid. So again, this reading may or may not be for you. This is like a prediction, right? That's what these readings are. They're really like predictions. But not every reading is for you. So let's just see what comes up for three months from the date that you watch it. We're going to start right here. What do we have for Gemini? What do we have for Gemini three months from now? What do we have for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. One card, please. Truth. This is the Judgment card. This is Judgment. Uh, some sort of truth is coming out. Truth is about to be revealed. So that's fantastic. This is a card of Karma as well. Somebody is going to be held accountable. They're going to be held accountable for their actions. This could be uh, a resolution, something coming to an end. There's forgiveness here. There's a spiritual awakening. Somebody may get a wake-up call because some tr sort of truth comes out. Okay? Uh, I mean, what more can I say? This is the judgment card. Are you ready to be judged? Somebody's going to be judged. Okay? Um, life-changing decision. Yep, yep, a, ju a, a judgment call is going to be made based on the truth. So you're going to be making a judgment call based on something that you, some facts, Okay, they're facts. So you're going to be making a judgment call. Truth is going to come out in a situation. Now this could be in regards to giving somebody a chance or not. Somebody may be asking for forgiveness. They may be pleading for forgiveness. I don't know who this person would be. But if you think about the judgment, you think about judgment. I was thinking, I was just picturing like a courthouse, okay? And I don't mean, I don't, I don't know if you're going to a courthouse. Don't. I was just picturing judgment where, you know, you're in front of the court and, you know, pleading. Somebody may be pleading their case to you. Whatever that means. And you get to make the call. You're, you're making the call, okay? So that's what it looks like. Two of coins. Now, Taurus got this as well. So, I don't know if you're dealing with a Taurus. You're dealing with a Scorpio. I don't know. But the two of coins is about a change. Interesting that Taurus got this as well. I was hoping for something different. <laughs> but, does it work out that way, does it? Life is about to change. And every word that comes out of my mouth is a message for you. You may have been hoping for something different, a different outcome, but that is not the case. Okay, that is a, for some of you, you are definitely dealing with a Taurus because we have the Hierophant on the bottom. Some of you are dealing, some of you are dealing with a Taurus, but there's a chance. This could be a reconciliation, so I don't know if you're dealing with a Taurus or not, but this, oh, it smells like something is burning. It's the wax. It's the wax. It's that hitting the wax finally. Anyway, um, two of coins. Now I just noticed the change. Something life is about to change, and this is life changing. Judgment is phoenix rising from the ashes as well. You've been in a difficult situation, um, so there is life is about to change. You may uh, see it may seem like things are very chaotic right now. This is a balancing act, needing to be flexible, needing to adapt, adapt to the circumstances. You're going to be adapting to something, um, a change. And it may be, I don't know if it's a court order. It definitely could be a court order that is a surprise. 
Okay, it feels like this is a surprise. I don't know what this is, but um, it looks like you're you're paying you're paying for something as well. So you may be paying. You may. Um, be foot in the bill, whatever this means, um, you're going to have some choices. It feels like you're going to be making a choice. You are definitely going to be making a choice. Everybody's going to be asking you what you want. What do you want? What do you want, Gemini? What do you want? And you're going to be like, well, I'll take this. I'll take that. You know, I feel like you're going to be making a choice this month. You're going to be given an opportunity. You're going to have multiple options. And I feel as though you may feel a little overwhelmed with the changing circumstances this month. Whatever is, if that's three months from now, things are about to change. Okay. Um, let's get one more. One more, please. One more card for Gemini, please. money path a path with money is waiting for you to find it and I see something about money here as well so there's there's something to do with money legs stepping into a new experience well this could be travel looks like you know this is this this could be traveling you are definitely going to be stepping into a new experience Gemini take a look at that Ah, successful outcome to your problems. So you're going to have some su sort of successful outcome to your problems. Interesting. And you're going to be stepping into a new experience. It's going to be a life change. This is definitely going to be a life change. Interesting. Very interesting. You may be given the keys to something. Hmm. What do we have for Gemini? It could be a judgment that's made in your favor. Something is made in your favor. And it looks like you're going to be priority. Whatever that means. You're going to be some sort of priority. Judgment again. Oh my. So, we got judgment again. So there's this is definitely a time of judgment. It's a time of resolution. It's an it's an ending. Judgment is absolution. It is rising from the ashes of a situation. So this is uh the end of things. It's a spiritual awakening. This is also someone from the other side. Some and you definitely have that. You have someone from the other side that is guiding you, that is helping you. This is about love. It is about love, some sort of love. This is forgiveness. Being forgiven. You are going, is there some sort of forgiveness? It feels like there's somebody from the other side that is, it feels like you're getting some sort of gift. I don't know if it's a gift of money or what. Successful outcome to your problems. Money path. A path with money is waiting for you to find it. Stepping into a new experience. This is like a new life. Okay, something is about, this is, this is something big. With, with two judgment cards, this is something big. Now this is, will you be accepted as well being accepted? This is a life-changing decision. You are going to be making a life-changing decision this, three months from now. You're going to be stepping into a new experience. This is big change. You're going to need to be flexible. Okay, this is about needing to be flexible. It's like, and, and it feels like you're going to be, it's almost like this is chaotic. This is chaos. This is crazy. This is crazy. Interesting. What do we have? The wheel. <gasps> Uh, the Wheel of Fortune is positive change. Whatever this is, this is positive. This is good fortune. This is good luck. This is being at the right place at the right time. This is very fortunate. 
uh, situation, whatever it is. One cycle of your life is over and a new one is beginning. If you, and then if I look at all the tens, okay, seriously, one cycle of your life is ending and a new one is beginning. And this is very positive change and it's going to bring you some sort of good fortune. I don't know what it is, but it's good. It is really, 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 really good. This is the wheel spinning in your favor. This is karma. This is karma. This is positive karma. This is. This is very good luck. This is a very good uh, change, whatever it is. This is, this is uh, beautiful. When I see a pregnant woman on the card, it reminds me of the empress and this is a reward a blessing you are going to be blessed you're going to be blessed with something very fortunate you are going to be absolutely smiling take a you are you are going to be smiling with this change whatever happens get that over there it should focus but you know how it likes to give me a hard time there you go you can see the smile on her face so yeah, you're going to be smiling. You are definitely going to be smiling. Smiling over this uh, completion, whatever it is. Something is ending and you're, you're making out like a bandit. Three of Cups reversed. The Seven of Swords. Somebody is getting caught. Truths are coming out. Somebody is getting caught in their lies. This it could be a group of bitchy women that you are dealing with or some friends that really aren't friends. This is parting ways. You are going to be parting ways with somebody that lied to you and betrayed you. But you're winning here, okay? You're winning here. This is this is like um This is definitely going in your favor. This is getting caught. Somebody's getting caught. Six of Cups reverse. Being relieved. Somebody's being relieved of their obligations. May have something to do with children. Okay? So we have children here, children here, and there's a child in there. So something to do with children here. Somebody is packing up and leaving home. They're moving away, perhaps. And it, I don't know if it's... Uh, Something is going to go in your favor. If it's like something to do with court, it's going to go in your favor. Somebody has been lying. They've been lying. They haven't been... Uh, there's a lack of growth here. I don't even know. Maybe there's been some child abuse with the Six of Cups of reversed. And the Seven of Swords up there. The Seven of Swords reversed. There's some sort of a neglect even. Somebody may have been lying about their lying to their children or lying about their children, something to do with children. Now the three of cups is a termination or a miscarriage, I hate to say that. So I'm wondering what is going on. Somebody may have lied though, because the seven of four swords reverse is a lie. Um but the three of cups reverse is gossiping, um enemies lying with the seven of swords. Somebody has been lying about their past or about a third party situation. Somebody's been lying. They may somebody may have even been using children. <laughs> Ten of Swords reverse. This is a painful situ situation. Very, 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 very painful. It's reversed. Okay, that is that is very painful. We have somebody here who's been suffering. They have been suffering. Oh my god. This could be Somebody has been lying and cheating and they're getting caught. They're getting caught. They're very, very, very unhealthy. Very unhealthy. It's like they're beyond help. Chronic health problems. There is somebody here that has chronic health problems.
And it's like they, I don't know, maybe, maybe, uh, oh, this is, go, they're going into rehab. I don't know where that is coming from. The worst has happened. And it, something has happened. There's definitely been a lot of deception with that seven. Extreme deception. Extremely hurtful situation. Whatever this is. I don't know who the hell you are dealing with. Five of them. There's going to be a fight. We got we got a we got a fight that is happening. There's a tug of war. There's there's a, a strong competition here. Somebody's not going to survive this competition. This is like an all-out war, so I don't know who the hell you are dealing with. You're going to win. You are going to win. This may be a war for, over the children. I don't know. I hate to say that. Um, but Or somebody from the past. Could be a third-party situation because we do have a third-party situation here. Um, something is about to be exposed somebody's poor health or whatever they've been doing is about to be exposed. And this exposure is going to benefit you in some way. Interesting. Hanged man reversed. Now, the reversed hanged man is obsessed. we got somebody here that is obsessed with control, hasn't learned a lesson, they've been hiding something. This is somebody who fights change, won't change, can't change, refuses to change, is very uh, egotistical, obsessed. So we have somebody here that is obsessed. They are obsessed. And with the Six of Cups reversed, that is uh, has something to do with children. Somebody needs to go into rehab. Looks like we have somebody who needs to go into rehab or they need some sort of help. They're beyond help. And they lie. They lie. So you're dealing with a liar. But something is about to change. You may say, why? Why is this happening now? I thought this was over. Why is this happening now? Why, 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 why? There is somebody here that... is not healthy. You may know it. You may have seen it. But this person was a very good liar. Seven of Swords. We have somebody here that is, and they may have gotten their friends or other people to believe them, but now the truth is coming out about this person. Knight of Cups. Now this is somebody that is very feeling, somebody that is very emotional, very, very uh, feeling individual that sees that there is no hope, sees that this is not healthy. So we, we do have somebody here that is coming into the picture. This person has entered the scene or they have entered the scenario. They see something is unhealthy. This person may be the one that takes a stand, that speaks up, that says something about this unhealthy individual. This is somebody who is very caring and kind and loving. They're a very loving individual that sees that um, something isn't healthy. Another, another, something to do with pregnancy. Something about a child or children. Something, somebody's, something about a pregnancy here. What the hell is going on? The star reversed is unhealthy. That is unhealthy, lack of hope, no growth. Illness. We got some sort of illness here. But this is a... Nine of Cups is a card of, of, of a wish being granted a new offer of love. So this is a, this is, or emotional support there. So there is some sort of emotional support coming in that is going to make you very happy because this is wish fulfillment. If you have been wishing for a child, you know, you're going to get your wish. If that's what your wish is. If some of you have been wishing for a child and you've been having fertility problems, you know, I don't see that being a problem. 
Um, somebody is, is giving birth or they're getting pregnant or they're getting a child. They're getting a child. Something to do with a child. Somebody may be relieved of their obligations because they neglected a child or they hurt a child. You know, there's something to do with a child here. Huh. This is unbelievable. Strength could be dealing with a Leo. Strength reverse. This is somebody that is very, very unhealthy. Uh, we could be dealing with an Aquarius as well. Or a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, with Pisces here as well. But some there's about to be a change. And somehow you are go you're gonna be Ask to something. My ear is starting to ring. The strength card is some. This is poor health. There is somebody that is weak, very, very weak. Lacks respect for others. Is very controlling. Is very unhealthy. So we do have somebody here that is definitely very, very, very unhealthy. But there is somebody that is is this. It's like this guy is coming. Sees it all. He sees it all. He's very emotional. He's a very feeling individual. This guy is, uh, could be a counselor, could be um, a therapist, same thing. Um, this guy is, uh, could be a, a, a nurse. He sees that somebody is unhealthy. He does. But this Knight of Cups is also, you know, it's headed towards this. And you notice there's two cups here. There's two cups right here headed into a relationship. So somebody is headed into a relationship. The sun. Somebody is dealing with a Leo. There is a, definitely a Leo here. This is an opportunity for happiness, an opportunity for growth. This is, is it definitely, it's a, it's a, it's a fertile time for new love. It's a time of, if you're looking to get pregnant, now is the time, okay? Three months from now. If you're looking to get pregnant, now is the time. This is a birth. So we have a birth here. There could be a birth of a child or a pregnancy or something like that. There's something definitely to do with a child here. But there's definitely a level of unhealthiness. So we have somebody here that is very, very unhealthy with the star card reversed and the strength card reversed. But this is healing. This is healing somebody that is unhealthy. So there, it's, it's crazy. It is definitely crazy. It feels as though you are going to be helping somebody to heal that is unhealthy. That's what this is. That is what this is. You do have a new opportunity here. And it, it, it does feel as though you're being given the chance. You're going to be given the chance because this is the chance. There could also be, this. if we want to spin this in another way, there could be somebody that is coming in. There could be a reconciliation here. They may want another chance. They may want forgiveness. They may have uh, released the third party, okay? Because this is the third party situation They've from obligation. They've released this person from obligation and they want to have a uh, rebirth with you. They want to have a relationship with you. There's definitely a reconciliation here or somebody wants you to give them a chance, whether this has to do with a child or it has to do with a, a partner, okay? There's an offer of, of coming in to you, Gemini. This offer could make you extremely happy, whatever it is. This is an offer that you are have been wishing for. You've been wishing for this, and here it is. Okay, this is a wish being granted. And it does have to do with uh, something that you... It feels like you... It's like you called it. You asked for it. Obviously, that's what a wish being granted is. This is going to make you extremely, extremely, extremely happy. But you're going to have to decide because this is a choice. You're going to have to decide. You're going to you're going to be presented with the choice. 
whoever you're dealing with um, has lied. They have lied and they uh, their lies are being exposed. They are being exposed um, or they're exposing themselves. They may not be able to do it anymore. This could be something coming back from the dead, the Ten of Swords reversed. So somebody is, 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 or they may have barely survived. Somebody may barely survive and now they need your help. Something like that. Um, so Gemini, three months from now, you are going to be sitting in the, uh, the hot seat and you're going to be making, you are going to be making a choice as to whether you want to give somebody a chance or not. Um, whether you want to take this risk, whether you want to take on this responsibility, because this is responsibility. So there is some sort of re responsibility that is being assigned. Okay. Um, and you're going to be making a choice. You are definitely going to be making a choice. You're going to have a couple of options. Um, This is somebody from the that you have dealt with before. It is. Good luck. 